That's my little kitty cat, isn't he adorable? <laughs> How many mornings do you get up and you look in the mirror and you see a little tiny kitten sitting on the other side of that mirror instead of a lion? We need to nurture our inner lion every single day in order to be confident enough to get in front of an audience, to get confident enough to write that book, confident enough to host that lunch or to speak for someone. And how do we do that? We build ourselves a personal board of directors. We surround ourselves by people who actually champion us. Not the ones who say the negative things, but instead the ones who say, yes, go for it. These are mentors, these are sponsors, these are champions, these are friends, these are the people who could be, they have no idea they're actually all on your personal board of directors, but you want the people that you are gonna pick up the phone when an opportunity presents itself. Don't say no first. Call up somebody and say, what do you think? Should I do this? And call up somebody who are one of your personal champions because they are going to say, yes, you should do this. And then they're going to help you do it. We need these people around us. Companies have board of directors. Why can't we have one? The other thing you could have is what I call a buddy system. A buddy system which might include having your own purse club. What's a purse club? Anybody? I met a woman at an event one day. She came and sat at a table at a lunch similar to the one we were in in the room where they had, you know, butter plates, wine glasses, everything was on the, plate, on the table for dinner. She came and she put her purse right in the middle of the table. She left her purse there throughout an entire meal. They were serving salad, they were serving wine, no problem, the purse stayed there in the middle of the table. I thought this was a little strange. At the end, I went around the table and I introduced myself and I said, oh, what a beautiful purse. Now, I was thinking something else, but we won't get into that. <laughs> I said, where did you get it? She says, oh, I just got this from my purse club. I said, purse club, anyone? What in the world is a purse club? She said, well, actually what happened, seven or eight years before, she and her best friend had realized no one was coming to help them with their careers. They needed a buddy system. They needed to help each other. So every time one of them was interviewing for a new job, the other one would sit down and quiz them on their questions. One and the other one was maybe writing a new blog post, the other one would read it for them. If they were going networking, they would go together and be the wing woman for each other. Every time something worked out, they gave each other a purse. Now she said when they first started, the purses were little teeny little purses like this big. But now she said her girlfriend had just gotten this awesome new job and she's just gotten this awesome new purse. <laughs> I think we all need a purse buddy, don't you? I'm thinking chocolate. I don't know, that's just me. <laughs> Regardless, whatever it is, find your buddy and find a system where you can reward one another for helping each other along the way. Being a change agent, being a thought leader is a bit of a lonely journey. And we wanna encourage you to celebrate with someone along the way. And if it's a nice purse or a spa vacation, whatever it takes, do that celebrating.